Okay, so in this problem, we've got that the initial speed of Anna is equal to four meters per second. And we're told that she decelerates at a rate of 0 0.10 meters per second per second. So the acceleration is equal to negative 0 0.10 meters per second squared. So the negative sign comes about because it's a deceleration. So in the first part of the equation, we're asked to calculate Anna's speed after 30 seconds. So in order to do that, we're trying to find V. So an appropriate kinematic equation to use is V is equal to U plus AT. As we know, T is equal to 30 seconds and we've already got A and U. So now we just have to substitute in. So we've got four. And now a, that's minus 0 0.10 times 30. So this is equal to four minus three. So that's equal to one meters per second. Okay, part two. How long until Anna comes to rest? So when Anna's at rest, the velocity is equal to zero. And we're trying to find t. So we can once again use v is equal to u plus a t. So we've got zero is equal to u plus a t. So rearranging this, we end up with t is equal to minus u on a. So now we can substitute in. We've got u is four meters per second and a is minus 0 0.10. So the negative signs cancel out and we end up with 40 seconds. In part three, we're then asked what distance has Anna traveled when she comes to rest. So in this case, we want to use S is equal to UT plus a half AT squared. And the time in this case is the 40 seconds that we calculated in part two. So U, that's four times 40 plus a half times A, which is minus 0 0.10 times T squared, which is 40 squared. So when we set solve that one on the calculator, we end up with 80 meters. So Anna travels 80 meters before coming to rest.